I'd like to take this occasion to thank all of the Periscope livestream community that engaged with me in January and February of 2020 on this Vietnam quest. Je voudrais remercier la communauté Periscope qui a participé avec moi durant cette tournée au Vietnam. Bonsoir Hanoi. Good evening Hanoi. Uh, welcome uh, Periscope viewers. Hey, is that for Mola? So this is uh, Hanoi at night. Par là-bas se trouve euh, le lac euh, important, un petit lac, mais il a une importance historique. So let's have a look. I'm not mistaken what it's just said. So. Santos. This is a rooftop in uh, Hanoi at night. It's uh, past nine. It's almost nine thirty. Over there the other day. Just saying, don't want to point because it's considered road in Asia. Oh, well, you can see a little bit of the lake. Just. Um, me pointing, I'll point with my pinky. Just over there, you can see the reflection in the water. Vous voyez le lac? Il y a réflexion dans l'eau. Hey, greetings, uh, Ghetto Finger Paints. Uh, this is uh, nighttime in Hanoi. I was asked to do uh, a nighttime bar but uh, I didn't really feel like going out to a bar seeing as I have a cold and I've got my own rooftop terrace all to myself and you guys, of course. So, um, hey Umberto. So let's check out the neighbors. Yeah, I think so. Oh, by the way, I've got a bar downstairs that um, now, as long as I bring my empties back, I can get another beer. So I can have how many beers I want as long as I keep bringing the empties back. And no chucking the uh, bottles over the side, please. Shenzhen, come visit. Um, one day. One day I might come. Well, you got to pay for them. I mean, I can drink as many as I like, as long as I keep bringing back the bottle. And by the way, I'm making a toast to absent friends. Cheers. Uh, yeah, it's breezy right now. And uh, even though it's winter time, uh, apparently, you know, they say it's colder in the north. Thank you, Sky Owl. Um, I'm not feeling it. This feels like a typical cool summer evening back where I'm from in the, you know, the mid-twenties. So I have bit bitten at, in the calves by mosquitoes because I've been wearing like cargo shorts and uh, I have had the odd mosquito. The odd mosquito bite. So this door, the wind is making it sort of uh, so why don't we do something about it I think I can close it not sure how yeah. Yeah. I just don't want to be locked out of course I could be locked it out into the worst places don't you think so let's have a look over the ridge here because I got a bench although it's metal it's not very comfortable okay so that's the little street. Don't lock yourself out. Eh, I'll try not to. So that's the little street down there. 
I do have a drone, but uh, there's no way you're going to use it in the city. I don't want the military coming after me. Thank you. Not going to do it. Uh, technically, yes. But if you bring the full force of authority down on you for breaking all kinds of rules, of course, you know, if you're a responsible drone flyer, it's not the, the wild, wild west, you know, you got to behave responsibly. And in fact, I happen to belong to the drone community and uh, doing something off of a rooftop in the middle of a city would be considered a no-no. It just would. <laughs> Hi Persia, how's it going? AKA Iran, yes, I understand. I don't know any salutations in Persian, but um, I'm extending them to you. I hope things are, are doing well. You are not that far from church. Um, okay, if you say so. Uh, I was uh, I was scoping your Saint Joseph's Kith, Saint Joseph's cathedral uh, yesterday and uh, it was quite uh, quite the uh, nice uh, afternoon scope yeah well you saw that one the uh, sky you were there you were there contributing I just realized that I don't have my um, relatively expensive Rode mic on, which gives uh, you guys quality audio. So I'm going to mic myself up. Welcome to your first uh, day on Periscope, uh, Sarah Grigg. Okay, now we're going to do this. Okay, you might hear a little uh, click of some kind. Yes, I'm still here. You know what? Tet is coming up. I've been warned. Tet is coming up. Let me just plug my mic in. Can you tell the difference? If you prefer this audio as opposed to the one that is better. Okay. Okay. So you see, that's my Rode uh, Smart Lav Plus. A microphone and it cuts out a lot of uh, ambient sound as much as 75% um, so whatever's close to it like me talking I'm yeah I'm glad to hear that and I'm glad for you guys because it makes for a better experience so that was what I was recommended the other night uh, but it was raining so I would have gone up there looks like there are people up there and a little while ago, I was kind of looking over there. And if you see, they're kind of covered up, but um, there are people up on that little terrace. And uh, they must be afraid of the rain or something because they're bundled. So, yeah, Ted is coming. And um, what happens is, is that everything shuts down. Uh, not that I know of. You know, Southeast Asia is a very modest culture. So there is no like public uh, displays of affection, <laughs> mind you, anything else. Uh, maybe, you know, you'll get the odd adventure, some uh, traveler that will try and get away with uh, stuff. But uh, the other day, in an early morning scope on this very rooftop, we did see open bobs. I'm not gonna say where, but uh, we definitely uh, we were flashed with open bobs on this very rooftop. Yes, oh, 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 yes. And, uh, and all of the Turks who are so fascinated with open bobs must have missed it because I hadn't seen a single one of them come into my scopes. <sighs> okay. So uh, there's such a thing as night markets, but I believe they come on the weekend. So 
Euh, Paris, France, bonjour, soyez le bienvenu. On est à Hanoï au soir, au, au toit. Pas loin du... Ben, on est au centre du vieux Hanoï. Bon, ben, bonsoir et bonjour pour vous. Yes, Open Bob's is a very famous periscopism. Magnifique, en effet. Hello, uh, there, um, um, uh, comment allez-vous? Hola, hola. Ah, ravi, ravi. Un poquito. Oui, je parle français, euh, Ménouche. Je parle assez bien. Assez pour me faire compris. <rire> Des fois, je me... Je m'attrape. Excellent. Excellente. Très bien. Est-ce que c'est en Vietnam? Si! Si! Est-ce que c'est en Vietnam? Hanoi, Vietnam. Oui, oui, c'est la capitale. Donc, euh, il, il y a encore du trafic, mais c'est moins brillant euh, à cette hauteur. Il y a moins de bip, 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 bip. Et il y a beaucoup d'édifices euh, influence européenne, beaucoup d'édifices euh, RS, Francis, un peu des deux. You love polygods. Well, thank you, Manush. I know a few, and yes, I'm, I am impressed with polygods. I have to say... Um, You know, they have, uh, they have a skill set that can go far, that can take them far. Tu es où, là? Je suis sur un toit. Je suis sur un toit. À Hanoi, dans le, le vieux quartier. Donc, je me trouve à, au septième étage. You know Esperanto. OK. I'm not sure I do, but I kind of like, ça me fascine le, that's the language of the future. Ça me fascine les, les immeubles, les immeubles sont très étroits et ils montent en hauteur, pas plus que huit, euh, pas plus que huit étages. The, uh, the buildings are really narrow and uh, they go up in height, uh, but typically not higher than uh, eight stories or seven stories and somewhat lower. You know, you get some that are just three stories. Um, well, yes. I mean, we, I'll give you what I give everybody as an answer. I am old enough. <laughs> I am old enough. I'm old enough to order a beer. <laughs> yeah, me too. Okay. There you go. You're over 18. That's, that's, that's a good thing, being an adult. It comes with certain responsibilities and how one should conduct oneself. You brush your teeth. Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't need permission for that. And you don't need to be told. Well, I'll take your word for it because I can't verify, uh, Minush. From where I am on my rooftop, I cannot verify whether you do actually brush your teeth. So we're on the honor system. We're going to have to trust you. <laughs> 